One of the things that greatly concerns me today is the appallingly low level of public conversation. We must find ways of re-engaging and reconnecting with each other across traditional boundaries and divisions. We need to find a way to raise the standard of conversation and to engage in constructive forms of dialogue. In Conversations That Matter, I'd like to talk about what things we can do to make our children's lives better. I think an issue we really need to talk a little bit more about is how we can link jobs and uh, climate change action. I would like to have a conversation about the relationship between Australia and China because I feel like currently a lot of the debates and discussion are really polarised. I want to have conversations about a realistic, sustainable transition away from coal because I care about the environment and my small town community that may be left behind. I feel passionate about the environment because we're seeing the impacts of climate change and increased urbanisation and pollution. I think we need to be talking about the issue of echo chambers on social media and we also need to be engaging with people who have different views from ourselves because otherwise we're only going to have a very single view in the world and we're not going to be able to look at things from different perspectives. I think Conversation at the Crossroads provides a unique opportunity to open up such a space and to reconnect with a form of politics that I feel is sadly missing from our culture today. The challenge is no doubt formidable, but the stakes have never been higher.